Once upon a time, there was a boy. And a dog. Who met a very pretty girl. They fell in love and started a lot. In hopes to make the world a better place. This is our story. Good morning, everybody. Do I look like I'm in LA? Not. Orlando, Florida, baby. Uh, these things are the best, uh, like, little devices ever. Best by, like, express machines. I just want to buy something to, to show you guys how awesome it is. Hold on. There it goes! I decided to get some new headphones for the plane. Gold and white. I'm telling you, robots are going to take over the world. Thank you. I appreciate you, little robot machine that robot Best Buy. Rental car, when you can pick from anything that you really kind of want or that they have, and you're uh, a band that plays and rents a bunch of cars, why not get the Charger? This thing is sick. And it goes real fast. I feel like uh, doing like one of those as it goes around the entire car. Okay, I gotta admit, this car is pretty awesome. Uh, I promised Jenny I wouldn't vlog and drive, so I will see you at where I'm going. It's, I can't tell you just yet, but it's with Danny and Lindsay. Pretty excited! Some of you guys might have guessed where I am. Uh, here it is. Universal Orlando Studio, 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 Studio. Uh, I lived in Orlando for a little bit of time, and I actually never went to Universal Studios while I was here. So I figure since now I live in LA and I'm traveling to Orlando, it's kind of like I'm a visitor. So it works, right? Yeah, a little bit? Anyways, I'm going, and I'm meeting Danny and Lindsay here. So I gotta find them, and it's kind of a, a big place. So I don't know where I'm gonna go, but it looks good. All right, so I found my dad and best friend, Danny. <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> he got me in. We are uh, just the duo going around Universal Studios. Is that what dads um, do? Dads just go like this all day? Oh boy. Yeah. Oh boy. Uh, I didn't have one, you, I don't know. Oh God. <laughs> <laughs> you want to play catch or something? <laughs> I can drop you off at the park with your friends. Let's build a skateboard ramp. Uh, do all the things. Let's make up for like years and years of uh, daddy, uh, daddy abuse. Well. <laughs> that clip's going in. Uh, we're gonna go meet up with Lindsay and, um, and, and some of Danny's uh, friends. But all I want to do, the only thing I'm here for is either E.T. or the Minion Ride. That doesn't make sense. E. The only thing that I'm here for is either this or that. Uh, E.T., yeah. E.T. is from like 1991. The, the pedal squeak on the bike, it's awful. <laughs> it's, <laughs> it's realistic. In 91, they, there was no <laughs> grease lightning like shifting into 18th gear or whatever. It, it wasn't about that. It was all about this little kid and this little red hooded freak, you know, on the uh, making him fly and <laughs> ET. What the hell are you talking about? <laughs> I guess we're currently looking for the, uh, the subway station 15 and a half. Or is that it? Not in three quarters. Not in three quarters. I'd be, <laughs> I'd run face first into 15 and a half. Be like, no, dude, it's totally gonna work. And just <laughs> knock myself out. Watch, as, watch, as, watch, watch the dragon. Wasting a bunch of my footage right now. <laughs> Better buy me some new film. Up. Uh. Worth it. Worth it. <laughs> Slowly but surely, we the kings is coming together. I'm waiting for somebody to get hit by that. That little clock tower thing spits out water for no reason. Uh, and, and just something like there's witches walking out. Don't do it. And then <laughs> that would have been awesome. Everybody in the picnic table was like, they, they saw it. That was too close. That was too close. That that was awesome. Uh, but anyway, slowly but surely, all the We the Kings is meeting up in Harry Potter world. Charles and Allie just arrived. Just waiting for Hunter. Doubtful that he'll be here. He'll be here. And Cole's trapped in a blizzard in Connecticut. Uh, but he'll be here too. That's it. dragon that spits fire, I guess, and it should be pretty fun to, to see if it ever happens. I don't think it's gonna happen, though. No. 
just grab it. Ah! Charles, it's like One Direction. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> yes, please. Look at that wait time. Wait time. Five minutes. Five minutes to meet Megan Fox. Let's do this. And and sh oh. sh Shaliba Abuff. Shia Shia Buff. I've I've never been able to say that kid's name. What is it Shia? Shia Buff. Shia Buff. The booth. Yeah. I don't even think that's it. I'm very excited to be on this Transformers ride right now. Last time that we came, uh, Charles got in trouble for videotaping. I'm going to see if we can get away with it. Uh, I probably, with that being said, will not be able to get away with it. I'll try it for you guys. And keep arms and legs clear of EVAC's door. I think you're supposed to press them. Wait until you are We're all little kids. We just keep pressing a bunch of buttons. Button smasher. I just got so sick. On the Transformers ride, I uh, I puked up a little bit in the trash can. There's not <laughs> there's nothing worse than being sick, like pukey sick. Ugh. Now my mouth tastes like throat. Uh, probably too much information. Ugh. This is kind of cool. The Hogwarts Express. I've never been on this one. I'm still feeling a little. <laughs> is this a ride or is this just the walkway to the yeah, other one? I puke on this one. There's like two loops. What? They're like. There's no loops in the real Hogwarts Express. Just gotta go through nine and three quarters. So you gotta write that time and uh, hopefully not few. Nine and three quarters. Sure enough. There it is. I'm doing it. I figured it'd be more straight. Six X. This is actually a pretty cool little roller coaster thing. Oh my gosh! You go upside down 14 times in here. Dude, you and Danny are so obsessed with wanting to see me too. It's crazy. There it is! Don't worry, it only goes upside down once. So this is the real one that you use in the real thing. Yeah, yeah. Cool. they donate it. That's crazy. Yeah, they don't want to support it, so they give the universe to it. People on YouTube are going to be like, dude, you guys are lying. Fake! You guys are fake. Tired. So we're in a train that you can't see the outside. It's just. It's essentially a Hogwarts movie. It's gotta be another train. This is gonna be so slow. I don't know if they're gonna away. Right? Yeah. I feel like it was, but it's maybe not. So I think it's because I'm riding backwards. We're going this way, I think. Maybe. Are we? No, we're going to go. Well, no, we're going Like, you can't open it at all. There's no way to get out of this thing. I think that's what it is. It's like claustrophobia, and then nobody seems to care. It's just like, chill, like, this is normal. Our, our biggest phobia is sick, I might die. You have a phobia of vomit? Yes. <laughs> oh my god, that's awful. Little baby's doing it right now. <laughs> yeah, but he doesn't know any better. Look, he's trying to... He would go right into the forest. We're here! I finally puked. Uh, luckily it was only water because I didn't have anything in my stomach. But I felt bad because there were people sitting right behind me. And they were like, oh, and they left. <laughs> And then a bunch of the waitresses came over and asked me if I was okay. But, uh, I, I hate puking, it's like the worst thing in the world, but you feel so much better after you do. Um, I gotta go find everybody else. For those of you who don't know, uh, Danny, Charles, and I are Wi-Fi boys. Um, we've done this thing for a really long time where I try to pretend that I'm also a Wi-Fi boy. It's really just them two. Uh, so I pop into the picture and then they end up beating me up. I'm gonna try to show you this right now. Yeah. That's what we do. <laughs> it's really funny. Anytime we see like a really cool background, we do that little four shot burst. So I found the best shirt ever. Minions, everywhere. It's not the cheapest shirt in the world. <laughs> a, a symbol, the Minions. That's like us guys, we're the Minions. Yeah. So, like if we all had the shirt, we could all be minions. I've been told I look like Thor by somebody at the park. <laughs> I don't really see it. 
They probably just mean like with the muscles and stuff like that. You know, uh, you know how people do it. Like the muscles are pretty much the same. The face is a little different, but the, the muscles are you know right there. I think it's also with the hair down. So like if the hair's down. That maybe I don't know. I just noticed I'm waiting for valet for the car and I just noticed that Starbucks uh, botched my name again. Uh, so I'm Jarvis. <laughs> Uh, they have a percentage of like 10% correction percentage, not the best. So there was no mirror to actually look at the shirt and try it on and, and see. Um, I'm now for the first time seeing how ridiculous the shirt is. Uh. <laughs> As your friend, I feel like I need to reassure you on your purchase. That it's it, awesome? It, it is a solid purchase. I feel like... Kanye would wear it and people would be like, that's awesome. You know, but if I wear it, people would be like, what are you thinking? Even if people said it was awesome, he'd make the headlines. Like every news agency would be like, look at Kanye's shirt. I'm worried about- So I should wear it tonight. <laughs> would you wear it again? Oh yeah, like daily? Hold on, that's hanging up in your closet. It's next to like one of your slick, low cut collar ones. You're like, nope, not that one today. The Minion shirt. A really in sync shirt that I used to wear all the time. If you are an old school fan of We The Kings, I used to have this in sync shirt with all five of the guys and there was a heart around Justin Timberlake's head for whatever reason, that's how I bought it at the thrift store. I would wear this at a show, yeah. How about this? I'm gonna give you a money-making opportunity. Every time you wear that shirt, every time you wear that shirt after this, I'll give you $3 for the day that you wear it. So assuming you wore it every day for the next year, you'd make over $1,000. Worth it. <laughs> As an undershirt? <laughs> okay, so I decided when you're sick, there's nothing better to do than just go bowling. Just get out of your head, you're not sick. And I found the grossest thing I've ever seen in my life. It's the uh, a bowling ball that you can test out which finger size you are. So, it's just sitting there. There's large, extra large, double XL, extra, extra small. But anyways, it's just sitting there right after the counter. So you pay for your bowling match and then you jam your fingers into this ball. So everybody in downtown Disney is just jamming their fingers in that ball. Is that funny to anybody else or just me? Probably just me. That's the way I roll. And for the record, I'm still wearing the shirt. I refuse to give up. What better way to make you feel better at night than to come bowling with all your best friends? That's, this is what we're gonna do all night. We're gonna bowl, we're gonna be merry, and I just got a really cool, uh, interesting offer. Hot Wheels wants me to write them a song. Sure. My good friends from Tampa, uh, if you guys know anything about me, one of the things you might want to know is that I'm from Bradenton, Florida. Even though I live in LA with Jenny now, uh, my friends from Tampa came all the way to Orlando to like, just kind of hang out with Playlist Live, and they found us at the bowling alley. This is Sharon and Adriana, and they're awesome, and they just are gonna hang out with us for, what, like 20 days? Yeah, they're coming on tour. So we're, we're just, we're just grabbing girls and actually, Jenny, I'm sorry. <laughs> I want the record to show that I won 156 to 82 to 120 to 88. And my, excuse me, sir, you're the the bowling lane. My Starbucks name is what I use today, so Jarvis is my, uh, my bowling name. I feel like uh, Iron Man's robot. Okay, we weren't able to finish the second game, uh, but I did lose. However, I lost with style. Go to Danny's vlog and check out. I, I shot the ball, and then without looking, I struck a pose. We got the whole thing on film. It's actually pretty badass. So I lost with pride on that second game. I appreciate you filming that. Please put it in your vlog. Thanks in advance. <laughs> uh, you transition and everything. Today or yesterday, Solid photo bomb. Solid vlog bomb. I forgot about the beer. Uh, <laughs> yesterday, uh, I believe it was, was my beautiful Grand Mary's birthday. She just turned 80, even though she doesn't look like a day over 29. I'm 29, so she looks one day older than me. Uh, it was her birthday. They threw her a surprise party. It was kind of like a ballroom dance recital type thing. And my brother pulled off the sickest dance moves I've ever seen. I'm gonna insert the footage right here. Somebody filmed it up and down, so you're just gonna have to live with it. But it is so great. Watch. Oh, my God. 
Hands down the best dancing you've ever seen. That's what I thought. Feels like we're walking through like uh, a scientific yeah. thing. They should be like on the ceiling. When you're in the this reminds me of Poltergeist. In Poltergeist though. Yeah, we're real. It was real, it? Charles is a five-year-old playing asteroid. This is the end of the night. We made it home. I kind of won bowling. I kind of lost bowling. It was uh, fun nonetheless. We're going to do uh, movie night. And uh, I'm like, I'm the third wheel. Jenny's back in L.A. She's passed out already because she has to work all this weekend on a film that she's doing about sex trafficking. Can you uh, keep it down, bro? She... We're trying to make out. Okay. <laughs> mm uh, so that's gonna be happening. I'm just gonna be sitting here uh, like third wheel sitting like with a lamp on right next to me yes. oh, wait, How long are you guys doing that? I wasn't even pointing it over there Forever. Uh, so this is what's happening. Uh, I love you guys and I hope that you had a phenomenal evening uh, Tomorrow starts day one of playlist live all those people that were walking around that got to uh, Say hi to us and and uh, and say that you like the vlogs. That was really thoughtful and it was so nice to meet you guys uh, hope to see you again this weekend, and I uh, hope you guys enjoy the show that we're playing Saturday night. Uh, until tomorrow. Love you. Bye. Oh my god! Yes, Tom Brady! Yes! Yes! Woo! Holy! Oh my god! That's unbelievable. Babe, you're in a movie with Tom Brady. <laughs> <laughs>